Hi guys, it's Damaris. I wanted to share with you my Amy Tangerine Day Book that I filled out and um, what I used in it and everything. So, uh, I had no idea when I first got this that there were a few other books by Amy Tangerine. So, I didn't really look at the label to know which book this one was. <laughs> and um, so I do apologize that I don't have a, a like a like a name for you or an item number so um, I'm sorry about that but you can google it I'm sure and you can find that out so my um, thought was to bring this with me to New York and to fill it up as I went you know throughout my vacation fill it up with the photos that I take and with little, you know, things, memorabilia from my, you know, two weeks over there. And um, it was actually really easy to do and really fun. And the cover here says, now you're in New York. And it comes from the lyrics of the chorus from a song that Alicia Keys sings with Jay-Z called New York and then at the bottom here the sticker says love this place so um, that's how I decided to cover it like that and then um, when you open it the first pages has us this is a photo I took on the plane of us three and that's hubby and that's Gio he's so big He's getting so big, he's learning a lot of new words, teaching him sign language, but that's just another thing. Um, so I used a lot of stickers and I brought with me a whole pouch full of stickers and die cuts and pockets and washi tape, yada yada. And I was able to incorporate that in the book. And um, here I have a studio calico wood veneer that I colored in with a magic marker and that's why there's this red stain here because when you close it it wasn't fully dry that's okay these are the tickets from our um where we sat and I just saved it and um Gio got a ticket even though he didn't get a seat but he still got a ticket to board the plane there's a little sticker this one and then this one came in the same pack and then this here, this thing is a printable file that I found. I think it was on Pinterest. And what I did was I separated it in half and extended it so it could look like it's a long strip. And um, basically it pulls out so you can read all about it. And down here I added journaling, some tickets. And then on this page here, this is... Um, this little journal spot right here this is either simple stories or um, echo par I think it's simple stories though and I just made a little um, pocket with washies and um, this pulls out this tag and it shows a picture of Gio with his um, cousin playing and one of my sister-in-law who fell asleep talking <laughs> I thought it was funny and I added that behind this spot right here this is a rub on that I just colored in it's very random here's another wood veneer that I colored in this page is um, is about Gio who did poopy in the shower it was his first time in the shower and I usually just take him baths never a shower but they didn't have a bathtub so he ended up pooping in the shower and I didn't even realize it so I thought that was pretty funny so I wrote about that and then on this side was when we went to this place called Grace Pizza in, in um, Brook Queens and that's me eating my first uh, was it my first or my second I think it was my second because I had eaten some before in another place and um, that was the date and then on this side this is a cute little um, French fry box that they gave us in the Happy Meal at McDonald's. And it was so cute and tiny that I decided I would just smash it in here 
and it creates a little pocket for this picture of him. I don't know how well you can see that because when I'm looking in the camera it looks black to me. But um, this is him eating at McDonald's, his little Happy Meal. I usually don't get him Happy Meals. That's why I didn't know that they, they sell these little cute little boxes. And then it, Happy Meal came with um, some toy and it also came with this card. And um, I just put it here and I added a little journal piece that I glued with a paper clip. And that becomes, you know, a little memorabilia for that day. Um, on this side, I think this was Friday, the day that my nieces came down. My niece and my sister-in-law. This is my sister-in-law right here, Kimberly. That's my niece, Jocelyn. That's my niece, Amanda, that I haven't seen since my wedding, which was like six years ago. And then that's me. And we're all in this one, like I think it's a full-size bed. And um, so I made like a little washi tape waterfall. So you could see all the pictures of that night. And then this was during the day. That's hubby. It's really dark because the photo was indoors and I didn't know how to put the settings on the Instax. I didn't change it. And that's my sister-in-law. And then these are my two nieces sharing icy, being vulgar. So that was those pictures. I put a little doily behind it. Some stickers, a little ticket. I think this is definitely Echo Park. And then on this side was when we went to the beach. That's my brother Abner and his wife Kim. And this is just some stickers and um, punch outs. And that's me. And it's just a cute little page about the beach. And then on this side, this is a pocket. This right here. I, I think that's from Amy Tangerine. I really don't remember. But I think it's it's by either her or Dearly. It was, it was in a package. I think it's... I really don't remember. So I apologize. But um, this is the page of the wedding. And um, it says, here comes the bride. Be for bride. Party time. There's like a camera on the pocket. So I glued it down to this semi-circle page with some washi and some bling and then this is these are the flowers that were thrown at our wedding and I managed to grab two on the way out from the um, ceremony and um, just to keep it in the book. And then there's one of these Studio Calico flares. So what I did was since I took a lot of photos at the wedding I um, punched holes in the Instax pictures and this was her before the wedding with her dad. So that's my niece Michelle and then that's my nephew and my sister Nancy. Here's my niece Jessica walking down the aisle. And this was Gio <laughs> and he actually took this picture. Because he saw that I was pressing a little button on the Instax camera while taking photos. And while I was just holding the camera while all the other people walked down the aisle that I didn't know. It was it was just in my hands like this. And it was just, you know, standing, sitting in my hand. <laughs> and he went and he pressed the little button in the front. And this is what came out. So I thought it was so funny. Like... It was such a quiet ceremony and he kept talking and being loud and I was like, oh God. So this is their first kiss. And then this was him taking out the garter. And then this is my niece being taken out the garter also. So, so that goes in this little pocket right here. And then on this side, I just um, put this tag that came from Colorbot Collection that you can still buy now at uh, Joanne. It is, we're in July of 2012, just in case, you know, five years down the line you're watching this video <laughs> and you're like, I can't get that. So you could still get it now, July 2012. And um, I basically put in here with a paper clip the, the oh, well, I stapled that together, the little, um, place card of us 
and then our numbered table here that they had at the table. I just took it <laughs> and um, I did a little pattern on the camera here on the wood veneer with a marker and it says uh, things I loved about your wedding so it listed everything about the wedding and then on this side there's a card that I also added with some journaling about the wedding in the back and it just stays there with a clip then on this side this was a photo I took of my niece Jessica and this was way before the wedding as you can see them the date so I was showing her what a day book is and what I was doing with mine and she liked it and then I taught her how to do this uh, rub on here because she like she's totally not into crafting as deep as we are so I was teaching her about rub ons and I let her do this one on this particular page and she loved it so much so I took her photo of her doing a rub on and um, I let her do this page so this is her page that she designed and this is what she did with it <laughs> And then on this side, um, this is just some journaling I did because I got sick right after the wedding. Actually, the same night as the wedding, I got really sick. And I just was home most of the time, sick for like five days straight. We ordered White Castle, which is one thing I really wanted. So I took a photo of the White Castle and then I cut out this piece from the box. And then on this side, um, it's a photo of Gio in the sink in my sister's house. So now we're at my sister's house. And um, this is like a common thing for Hispanic people to wash their babies in the sink. So I thought that was cute. And then on this side, um, more journaling. We went shopping this day. I finally was feeling a little better and I saved the receipts. I went to Joanne and I went to some dollar store went to I think it was Michael's I don't remember but um, I did manage to save the receipts and I put this is love and I created a little pocket behind here with some journaling and we had Chinese that night and that was my fortune and then on this side was the day that um, I started to teach my 11 year old niece all about smash books and so she got hers out and we got a lot, all our supplies hers and mine and there's a lot more stuff that you didn't see in a picture and so we just started smashing so I took her picture with the table and added some little butterfly punches around with some bling and some journaling here with a doily and then on this side I just put like word stickers about this day and that's the date on this side I think this is my favorite um, page of all this is like a brown little um, what you call this like a little brown bag that you would put stuff in to give away and this is a little ticket this one here boy my uncle park and I just added antics and then this says life unscripted is a stamp and um, inside there's two pictures and the pictures show Giovanni playing around with toilet paper in my sister's house that she caught him. She went and she took the pictures of him. <laughs> so I thought that was funny. He was so like, uh oh. <laughs> so I thought that was cute. And put that there and I added some banners here. And I had bought a lot of different paper pads at um AC more and so I added it to the and then here's a uh, envelope page that I just put a drawing piece over and inside I added the photo of, of AC more which is super black and then the receipt at AC more and then um picture of the stamps that I took on my phone from AC more so that just goes in a little pocket here and like I said before in another video, I wasn't really impressed with AC more. I thought, it, you know, because from what people make it seem like it's like the best superstore in the world for crafting. But really, I like Hobby Lobby more. I guess because Hobby Lobby gives you furniture too to de decorate your craft room. So I added some stickers that I had gotten at the dollar store. These cute little um, aluminum type stickers. And on this side, um, this was funny. 
because the stove that they had was like leaking gas and like there was so many people trying to work on it that day so I just added a wood veneer and I colored him in a shirt and some pants a little flag with the date and then this was um, in the living room that everybody's watching TV and on this side was the same day mom was making some surullitos which Puerto Ricans know Spanish people know what that is it's like a cornmeal based um, like a pasty kind of cornmeal dough and um, it's like grainy and you stick cheese inside of it and you roll it up into like oval shapes and you fry it you deep fry it and it's supposed to have sugar in the in the batter and um, it's sweet it's like a sweet salty type you know it's just a snack so I took a picture of mom making it and um, journaled about it a little bit and then on this side finally was even better for my sickness to go inside their pool so this is a, us inside the pool and um, I journaled about it a little bit and put a little picture was able to print a little tiny picture of us on this side um, as I was doing my day book journaling Gio got a hold of my purse which he always does and he takes out everything and I let him because to him it's you know it's fun but sometimes when he goes through my wallet he takes out all my receipts and my cards and then I end up you know going crazy looking for it so you know I don't always let him take the wallet but I let him take the purse and it was so messy and I added a studio calico flare here and another wood veneer colored in some stickers and pieces of pieces of stickers um on this side I took a picture of the day book in its process and basically that's what that is <laughs> here's a, a one of those wood veneers that I colored in and then on this side this was hubby who had gotten my brother-in-law a birthday cake because it was his birthday so I took a picture of him putting the candles on the cake and that's that page and then on this page these two pages are the birthday so I took a picture of him with his cake he was surprised and I put happy birthday with a ticket on the date and there's this um, studio not studio um, Amy Tangerine I'm not even <laughs> I'm so confused with words um, dear Lizzie Neapolitan it's it's one of those Polaroid pieces it's got an ice cream on it and I just had it with me and then I spelled out his name and then wrote um, each letter what his name you know means to me he's a virtuous person he's very intelligent and he's very dependable this is Vid my sister's husband and I just took some pictures of that and then on this side um, we were crafting again on July 13th this was the night before us coming back to Florida um, and we had a huge mess on the table and we are just having fun and I took a picture of that and put it in the book. This sheet is completely empty. I don't know what I want to do with this yet. Over here, um, this was Friday night and, um, hubby was washing clothes so I just journaled about that. On this side, what was this? Oh, um... <laughs> is private don't read it um this is friday night also added some banners here and then on this side was the day we were leaving so this was saturday morning and this is a picture we took saturday morning and i had already prepped the page for this picture so that was easy to just add it on i also prepped this page and i took a picture of coming into JetBlue. And a picture of Gio at the airport having a snack. And then this is some journaling. Some more journaling here. And then finally a picture of the front of our house when we got back home. With some stickers and some tickets and things. And then the back is just empty to finish off my uh, thoughts. So that's my book. I hope you liked it. I bind it to uh, keep it closed with this little black rubber band. And um... That's about it. So I hope you liked it. Leave your comments. If you have any questions, leave them below. And I will try my best to answer them if I can remember to know what to answer. Um, that's it. Talk to you soon. Thanks for watching.
Bye, guys.